everyone. Um, I am at my parents' house this weekend. I am getting ready to go to Swiss Days Market. Um, I don't know if you've any of you have heard of it before. It is a market in Midway, Utah, and they just have a bunch of home goods, a bunch of booths um, with vendors that sell different things, and it's always very packed. <laughs> so we'll see how it goes today, but it should be fun. <laughs> we made it to Swiss Days. There it is behind us. It's like 8.30 and it's already really crowded. We got the baby all warm. It's a little chilly out here. So we got a blanket, jacket. You should put your hood on, huh? We're going to go check it out. taking a little break um, it was starting to warm up so I'm gonna take Regina out of her jacket and change her diaper I got a really yummy uh, Swiss roll sweet roll so I'm gonna eat that my sister and her family are coming to meet me, so I'm just going to wait here for them, and yeah, just taking a little break. We're at a little park that's across the street from the whole market, so we caught the end of, a, of the parade that was going on, so that was kind of fun, but anyway, do you want to say hi, Regina? Say hi! Is it so bright? <laughs> so, um, we got back from my parents' house last night. And I'm here with Regina. Say hi. <laughs> She's not feeling too great today. She had a rough night. But I thought I would show everyone what I got from the Swiss Days Market. Because I hadn't done that yet. And I got a few. They're just small things. But they're kind of fun. And so I thought I would show you guys. I've really been wanting to get a picture of Jesus. Um, we are Christian, if you didn't know. And so there was this artist called Young Soong Kim. I don't know if I pronounced that correctly, but um, 
I loved his art. He, it was a very modern take on Christ, and he, his art actually wasn't very expensive. But I decided to, in the end to get this book because it was cheap. It was only five dollars, and it had like a bunch of his art. Oh, and he signed it. <laughs> It had a bunch of his art in here and versus just like one. And it's just like a little children's book, like nothing too crazy, but I just loved his art. Like, look how pretty. That is the book I got. Then I saw this, there was this other booth of this girl called Savvy Drew, Savvy Drew Art. You know what, this lighting's not great. So I got some of her prints. I've been wanting to redo some of the decorations in her house, like this wall, both those walls really need to be updated. I've been trying to add pictures of like Regina. Um, we just got some family pictures taken a couple weeks ago when we were in San Diego. So I need to order some pictures and put them in there. And like, I don't know, I feel like maybe we have too many maps and yeah, we'll just see what, what happens. But I got some prints. And if you guys have any ideas for how to change my wall, let me know. But I got this one that says, Love Grows Here. I'm really loving floral. I always have loved floral stuff, but especially lately. This is The Shape of Utah, where I live. And then this is why I didn't end up getting a Jesus picture from the other artist, because I ended up getting this one, and I love it, because the picture of Jesus that I've been wanting is actually one where he's with a baby or a child or something, because I don't have anything like that, and I just think this is so cute and very modern. And then I got this one, the family proclamation to the world. This is um, something that my church has taught as like um, what the family should be. So that's that. And then this is the temple in Logan where we live and this is where James and I got married. So I love that. So there's the book again. And then the last thing I got was these bracelets for Regina. So ooh. So there's a black one. There is this, like, I think it's, like, goldish. This is having a hard time focusing. Maybe I'm too close. Anyway, it's, like, kind of white gold. And then this last one is brown. So she had some, she had a bracelet when she was newborn that my mom gave to her, and it, Ever since she grew out of it, I have been wanting to get her another one because they're just like a very girly touch, and where she doesn't have very much hair, it's like nice to have that indication that she's a girl <laughs> because, you know, sometimes it's confusing. Um, so yeah, uh, it was just fun to go shopping, and they do it every year on Labor Day weekend, so it's kind of like our family tradition to go, and... And it was a lot of fun. It was a really nice, relaxing weekend at my parents' house. And I'm excited to go again next year. But I think I'm going to end the vlog there today. Bye. Do you want to say bye? You liked that?